Sanamahism or Sanamahi laning to the traditional Maiti'i beliefs and religion found in the state of India called Manipur near Myanmar. The term is derived from Sanamahi, one of the important Maiti'i deities. Sanamahi derives his power from the combination of all the stars in the Milky Way. Lord Sun worships him for more power and he delivers all with ease. According to Bertil Lindner, Sanamahism is an animistic, ancestor worshipping, shaman led tradition. Sanamahism is practiced by the Maiti'i, Zelangrong, and other communities who inhabit Manipur, Assam, Tripura, Myanmar, and Bangladesh, with small migrant populations in the United Kingdom, United States, and Canada. Topic. Revival According to 2011 census, about 8% of Manipur belong to religions stated as other. Religion in Manipur is thought to have passed through three stages. Topic. Form of worship In assimilate features such as the worship of forces of nature like fire, water, mountain, ancestor worship, apokpie, lamlai, outdoor dwelling gods and goddesses, yumlai, house dwelling gods and goddesses, ningthulai, king god, and umonglai, forest dwelling god. Religion of antiquity, in its pure native form, it is as all as the history of Maiti'i people from the time immemorial. Topic. Deities There is reference to the worship of Sanamahi by Ningthau King Kangba in the Hai Age. Manipur is a polytheistic land with Atiya Sadaba as the supreme god. Atiya Sadaba, Apaanba and Ashiba are the three manifestations or incarnations of God as the creator, the preserver and the annihilator of this universe respectively. Panthoebi is the mother of the universe and Nongpak Ningthau is her mate. Besides those, 364 deities with their consorts are the most important deities worshipped by the Mighties. The plain Kabui are observed in worship of Sanamahi and Ima Limeral. Sanamahi, also known as Ashiba, has a creator brother like him named Paakangba, Kanjan Tukdhafa. Some of the important gods and goddesses worshipped by the Mighties are Shidaba Mapu, immortal owner. Laning thou Sanamahi, supreme god of the household gods and goddesses. Ibudhou Pa Kangba, younger brother of Laning Thou Sanamahi and the ruler of the outside world. I'm a Limeral Sadabi. Apokpie, prime ancestor god and goddess, different according to different surnames. Ebenhou Amoinu, goddess of prosperity, wealth and kitchen. Emma Panthoibi, goddess of valor and battle. Yumjao Larembi, household goddess. Emma Foiba, goddess of bounty. Ibudho Marjing, god of sports and also the protector of northeast direction. Ibudho Thongjing, god of power and also the protector of southwest direction. Ibudho Wangbrol, god of rain, death and also the protector of southeast direction. Kumar 2004, 92. Ibudho Kubru, god of strength and also the protector of northwest direction. They also worship the Umangle, forest dwelling gods and goddesses. Umangle are the protectors, preservers of their corresponding areas, localities which includes houses, fields, welfare of the people, etc. In short, the Umangle are the guardians of the outer world of the people and also these gods and goddesses are associated with each and every doings of the people in day-to-day -day life. 
Hence, they are considered to be very powerful. Some of the Umangle are Arong Ningdao, Wangjing Ningdao, Emma Irima Oinam Lakoi, Lainingdao Nongshaba, Lainingdao Puthiba, Lainingdao Awangba, Lainingdao Marjing, Lainingdao Korafaba, Emma Kunthak Hanbi, Emma Haurima Sampubi, Emma Irima Ekop Ningdao Thubal Ningdao Emma Kondong Larembi Nongpak Ningdao Langal Ningdao Emma Langal Larembi Ibudho U Nathingkong Pakangba Ibudho U Kamlongba Ibudho U Oknarel Ibudho U Thangnarel Ibudho u Yangoining thou. Ibudho u Kumabathe title, Laining thou, refers to the incarnation from Laining thou Sanamahi, and the title, Ibudho u, refers to the incarnation from Ibudho u Pakangba. Offerings <laughs> 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 Mites offer praying to the household gods and goddesses twice a day, once at dawn and once at dusk. They offer incense sticks, burner and candles, mira along with flowers and water. Devout Mites offer food at sacred spots daily to the goddess of kitchen and prosperity, Ebenho u Amoinu. See also Sanamahi creation myth Sacred books of Sanamahi religion <laughs>